<sighs> Zim Taiju O! Oh! This is exactly right after we just got done with 21. Hello! Welcome to episode 22. What up, Fluffle? How we doing? Pew pew! Y'all like, uh, Dragon Rexes with cannons? And you gonna see some of that today. But because apparently... today, Stacy's back. Back again. Eminem references aside, good to see that Stacy is coming back and is going to be in his mech and fight Kaito's new mech form. This ought to be a treat. Let's hop in. His hands are horns. What do you mean, move? <laughs> Not the soccer players. Or football players. They were actually. Why are you football. making horns with your hands when you have actual horns? Oh my god, he's Bart Simpson. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ooh. Really get this. Hey. Flamenco dancing? I he's the bull and the fighter. Yes. Yes. Ah, oh, so now they're going after Jure. Oh, right in the butt. Oh, he's a real matador. Go, old man, go! That's a weird way to do that, but okay. <laughs> he's like, okay, since so you want attention, bitch! <laughs> the bus. The entire bus is white. Why didn't they just attack the bus? Why aren't they attacking the guys in the, uh... The geese. I know that I know this bull man's voice. Run room! Lurking ass! I'm gonna smash him! Locked it in a cabinet! It started eating Kaito's food. And so he scared it off on accident. Bye! Well. Oh god, it's an actual attack. Not the people, too! It is. Kind of inhumane, but it is. <laughs> oh boy, are you gonna disappoint. Wow, I actually like your plan this time. <sighs> oh, he didn't do it. Mm. When you end a Pokemon battle with Whirlwind? <laughs> She's directly accused him of racism. No, nah, no, nah, he's got a point. I haven't seen you two, like, actually argue in a while. No, nope, no, nope, that's the right thing to do. I like how they're acting like that was a super tense moment because this is a very light-hearted show. I mean, relatively speaking, it was. Is there a hole in his head, Seichan? He has a name. Gold. Yeah. 
He is not having a good day. Right. It's kind of my cat. Oh. And then keep going. Not supposed to be intelligent. It was eating. Oh. I see. It'll show up when it needs to. Thanks, Flint. No. I don't think you did. Gowan has a problem. Man, I wish they had Mantis playgrounds when he was a kid. Hmm. They probably did, just not on your side of the planet. He twisted his robot ankle. Starting to appreciate your team, huh? Even though you're a full-blown racist, racist, you have the racism. Very, very odd way to go with your character in the lighthearted anniversary children's yes. series. Right? Let's make some of them robots, okay? And have him be full-blown racist against robots. Keep staring hard enough, you'll figure out that you have eye beams or something. That'd be awesome. Do what? You! Okay, Sechine, you actually are a bird, though. I understand giving this man the death glare, but you are a bird. No, you won't, you piece of shit. Yeah, what the bird said. Run, Red Lady! Is she gonna be okay? Is he gonna be okay? Are they going to be okay? Nah. No moping. Action time. Ain't you a little bit suspicious that he just ran after Kaido? And then said that? Hmm. Aww. Can't do it now, can you? You can't crush her grandson now, can you? Despite Usagi's protests, you're probably actually nicer than Zox, aren't you? <laughs> Magic! Change your color! Do something! Yeah, use rainbow dye or something. Turn into a truck and drive away! Yeah. How good would a pirate be at bullfighting? Good question. Oh no! Saw that coming. I love this show. <laughs> oh. Oh. His mech was a giant bull. I see. That was localized as Lost Galaxy here in the U.S. Came right after In Space. He was called Galactonite in uh, Lost Galaxy. No! Again? Now he's the danger. Great. God, every time civilians get turned into minions, Sox is like, oh man, I love hitting people. <laughs> oh, he got sparks from hitting the ground. Come on, Gown. Grow angry eyebrows out of your robotic face. Yeah, well, have you ever seen a tiger's claws? Get him, Gown, get him! You're not just going to wade through them like the ocean and hit this guy, are you? Ooh! Mm. Damn! Way to take one for the team! Kaito, quit staring! Do something! Yes. Fuck this net! I'm free! It really was just caught on something. 
Super! Taito loses his cape, but Zox gets one. I guess he's still lit. <laughs> oh, well. I never get tired of seeing him do that. <laughs> Drilled. Drilled. Not so strong without your herd, are you? Oh no, he saw the background change. <laughs> Mm. Gown, are you going to live? Ooh. Gown? He had to save you guys. Somehow. He did chase it off. He didn't lock it up anywhere, but he did chase it off. Yay! <laughs> uh, the big Did you guys guy? forget about the Kudai test? Uh, yeah. Grills? I can't believe they just jammed the spear up Kaito's butt. Stop! <laughs> also, oh, he's barbecuing the ground. Okay. Get him! Get him! I see. You said it was beef tongue! <laughs> White. White! That! Oh? And now they're a jet! Weird. Hurt. Uh oh. Yeah, you and who's your lip gloss? Oh, you had to. You had to. Oh. Ooh, it was. Two, huh? Ooh. Oh no, he's got the movement. Guys! Do something. Um, Zenkaiju's on the ground. Hello? Reinforcements? Quit, quit panicking. Be big. No! No, don't hang our clips. Mm. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Noodle shop! Flint in a cute red jumpsuit? We chased after the bullfighter's cape, but ended up left strung up to dry. How long have you been thinking up that? For... since the cliffhanger hit. <laughs> then speaking of, they gave us a fucking cliffhanger! The last time they did this was also right before a fight with the Battle Caesar Rover. <laughs> So, cliffhanger equals Stacy, Stacy equals cliffhanger. Got it. Every cliffhanger is just going to be about Stacy. Got it. Anyway, that was enjoyable. Um, I enjoyed seeing the Zen Kaiju O twice in a row. It turned into a drill jet. Yeah, that was weird was seeing a the. Odd. Knowing the, like, robot heart, seeing, like, the chest and the feet as the top of the jet was. Odd. It was just like a torso jet with its ass as a head. Weird toy design. They, I, I guess with the design they couldn't do much, but I don't know. I've seen cleverer. I don't know. I mean, he, he uh, got his ass. He got the job done. He destroyed those grills. Zox ate some uh, pure Wagyu beef tongue. I wonder if that, like, stays in his stomach? He said it was tasty. Because it was a Kudai test, transformed, and the world's freed, so all that stuff's gone now, and that wasn't it. Imagine you eat something, and then it just vanishes out of your stomach. Like... Cotton candy. Somewhat. I mean, the sugar is still in you. Yeah. 
whatever. Anyway, if you enjoyed that as much as we enjoyed making it, then be sure to give us a like and comment on this video, as sure is subscribing to the channel. <laughs> My tongue is betraying me today. Anyway. And if you're left hanging from the cliff, just call for the Zenkaiju gear. It'll come when you most need it. See you next time. We were not coordinated that time. No, but it was funny. <laughs>